Okay, so when you start Arathi Highlands out there coming in from wetlands, you, you end up right here at this bridge, and uh, there's this little way here you can go down here and accept this kind of hidden quest called Mackerel's Moonshine. And in order to accept this quest, we want to, we, you're, you're going to need to have an ability to move quickly, such as either a swift speed potion or aspect of the cheetah is good enough for hunters. And uh, over, over there is the bridge that goes into the wetlands, but over here is this little tiny. Uh, platform that we can make this jump from here to here but yeah you need an ability to move quickly in order to make this jump so we're gonna go ahead and just jump over there and when you get over here you'll see this quest giver here in this little hole, uh, cubby hole and um, this quest is on a, a 15 minute timer so we want after accepting this quest we want to work very quickly to do the next number of steps pretty quickly so as soon as you set the quest, you want to jump right into the water. And in the water, then immediately start uh, working your way towards the east. So we want to work our way east. In order to get out of here, there's this ramp way over here. So we have to kind of make a long swim here. And um, if you had a swim speed potion right now, right now would be a great time to use it. But since I didn't have one with me, we're just going to have to make the swim. As soon as you get right here, you can start walking on the land to work your way over there a little bit quicker. Yeah, like right here. So yeah, 13 minutes, 40 seconds re remaining, so we still want to work somewhat quickly to do the next number of steps before the timer runs out. When we get up here at the top here, there's going to be some enemies, and we want to try to avoid these enemies. Uh, we just want to just run past them, so try to distract them somehow. I'm just going to use my pet to just run into them and distract them. There's just, there should be some more enemies around here too, but uh, since they're not there right now, we're just going to run past them. So we're just going to run north into Arathi Highlands to Refugee Point, which is the Alliance Town in the middle of the uh, zone. And we're just going to do a few things there, and then we're going to start working our way to Stromgard Keep to do a few things over there. So yeah, there's a number of things that we want to do before the time limit is up. Eventually we're going to turn this quest in at South Shore. So we have 12 minutes to do this stuff here before the timer runs out. With the aspect of the cheetah, this, this is... Uh, this is just doable. So once we get to refugee point, we just want to turn in this quest. What can I do for you? Plead to Alliance. And then just get the flight path. And then we're done. And then we want to move our way to Stromgard Keep. Continue to work uh, to move pretty quickly through all this stuff. We want we're trying not to waste any time. Avoid any mobs along the way. We're not grinding along the way. So just avoid these mobs. So yeah, to get a Stromgard Keep, I recommend just going down here. There's a little shortcut you can go up through around up here. Uh, also, to get up here is a very tight squeeze. You have to follow this dirt path here and then up the mountain. So right in the middle of this dirt path and then right up here. It's a little tight. All right. So yeah, then the rest is pretty easy. We just go on top over here and then right through this door here. So in Stormgarm Keep, what you want to do is keep making right turns everywhere. Keep hugging the right side. Keep making right turns. And eventually we're going to buy three first aid books, and then we're just going to leave this place here. Now also keep in mind, right there is a little gap. You can't squeeze through there. I couldn't figure out how to squeeze through there. So we're just going to run right through this house here. Alright, so then right, just right past this bridge, make a sharp right, 
and you'll see the NPC to buy the, th the three first aid books right here. So get this one, this one, and this one. And then just leave. Now to, to leave, you can take a shortcut by jumping off the bridge right here. And just keep heading northwest to enter Hillsbrad. Also, you see the water here, how there's a little line between water and dirt. You can run right through the water right here. The goal now is to go to South Shore and to turn in the uh, time quest that we're on. Avoid, once again, avoid all the mobs. If you're a speed runner and you have Aspect of the Cheetah on, it, you can kill a couple mobs along the way. Because you, you do have around five minutes to spare once you get to the, uh, five, well, well, five or six minutes to spare once you get to the, uh, uh, basement of the end to turn the quest in. So you can kill a few miles on the way if, if you're speed running. You do have some time to do that. Just don't stop and like kill every single one. You can kill maybe, you know, like five to ten, possibly, along the way. If you're really trying to squeeze in some kills along the way, you can do that. If you don't have Aspect of the Cheetah, I, I don't know if I would take that risk. Not sure if that would be possible. You might be able to kill a couple along the way if you don't if you don't have aspect of the cheetah. All right. So once we get to Hillsbrad, we're just gonna make uh, a straight shot right to South Shore. The shot that I recommend taking is right above this farm. Don't go through the farm. There's a lot of enemies in the farm, so we just want to go right above the farm. So yeah, I find that if you just walk right along here, you shouldn't run into too many en enemies along the way. Okay, so where we want to turn this quest in at, in at is at the bottom in the basement of the inn. And as you can see, we still have five minutes remaining, so we're making some pretty good time here. Basement of the Inn, of course, right through here. And there you go. Great to meet you. See you soon. Quest complete. Thanks for watching.